Hi guys, Josh here, uh, formerly with Star Trek Book Reviews, but as you can see, we made a name change here, and now we're just talk about Trek, because that's really what I want to do, is just talk about Trek. So today what we're going to talk about, and I'm pretty excited, is fun Star Trek food finds. So I'm going to highlight uh, three just kind of rare things that I found that I've added to my collection that, that I really like. So uh, let's start with this. The Star Trek V Marshmallow Dispenser. Now this was released in the summer of 1989 by Kraft. It was something that you would basically do a send a check and do like a mail in order to get. You can see here it comes with your, your fork and your spoon. And you can even attach it to your belt there. So I've not opened it yet. But think in a future video we might see this sucker in action. So this is something I picked up down at a uh, just kind of like a local collector shop that we have in town and once I saw it I just said well that's got to be on the shelf. So that's a really fun one and, and hopefully we'll try that one out someday. Now the next one I want to talk about uh, I picked up at a flea market a couple of towns over um, something I had never seen before, but in the 1990s, in the UK and in Canada, uh, Nabisco put out a series of Star Trek-related cereals, uh, relating to, I guess, these shreddies here. And uh, so the box I have is the Next Generation, the thumbnail one. Mm -hmm. uh, this one is the Next, or the Generations one. And uh, when it came out, apparently you could send away for a free giant official movie poster. So let's have a look at the back here. It's a nice shot from Generations. Unfortunately, it's empty. And some of the ate the shreddies, but I guess that's okay. They probably wouldn't be too good now. But, uh, this, this is really cool. I'm always excited to see things like this. Yeah, they don't show up too often, and especially in this kind of great condition. I've got this one in plastic, but uh, too much glare, so I took it out for the video. But it's going to go right back in the plastic after this. So these are the shreddies. Now, the last thing I want to talk about here today, uh, one of my most exciting finds, uh, I was just on one of these Star Trek collectors groups online, and saw a set of these cups that I didn't even know had existed before. Let's take a look. So these cups were released uh, in the UK with Pizza Hut uh, in 1993 and in 1994. Uh, there was two sets, the original series set and then the next generation set. Now I've got six of these here and uh, I'm missing one from each set. So you see we've got the Romulan Bird of Prey, the uh, Tricorder, Type 1 Phaser, we've got the Klingon Battle Cruiser, there's the Communicator, get a closer look there, Battle Cruiser, Communicator, and the original Enterprise. The two I'm missing would be the Enterprise D and the original Communicator. So, kind of exciting, two more things that I'm kind of always going to be on the lookout for now. Uh, but this was an exciting thing to add to my collection. Uh, the condition was great. Uh, so that I was very excited about. So those were the three kind of retro thring things that I wanted to show to you guys today. Uh, uh, one thing that's not retro but also food related that I did want to show here is my pink peppermint dilithium crystal mint. So it's Scotty there. So we picked these up a couple years ago when they were doing a Star Trek exhibit at the uh, Henry Ford Museum. I think it traveled around to other museums as well. So we're going to go ahead and taste one of these right here live for the video. Well, as you can see, we've tasted some before. They're good. But it's always fun to taste one for the video of posterity. So these are the pink peppermint dilithium crystals coming fresh from the warp core from Scotty for you. Well, 
not a retro item now. Give them, you know, give them some time. They'll be here in the collection and they'll be retro in the future. So those were, that's all I had to show you guys today. Uh, but let's talk about Trek because what a week it has been. Uh, we've had a release of a trailer for Lower Decks, which is coming out just next month. We've had an announcement of new toys being made by Playmates, by the original sculptors, coming out next year. Toys for Lower Decks, toys for Picard, toys for Discovery, and apparently more than that. That deserves a whole video in its own right. Uh, so look forward to a video about my Playmates collection and what I'm looking forward to coming in the future as well because that is exciting news. And then also, uh, news of a new Star Trek movie. They've signed a director, maybe a writer, I believe. So, so much stuff coming down the Star Trek pipe. So, uh, glad you guys have been here watching, and uh, stay tuned for future videos. Make sure to like and subscribe, and slam the notification bell, and do all that YouTube stuff for me. Uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed, and we'll see you again soon. Bye!